Hi, I'm Louis Camels, and I designed the Earth Movement Sun Orbiter, or Tellurian as it's also called. It can be used to predict solar and lunar eclipses and to demonstrate the rotation and orbits of the Earth and Moon. Made mainly in brass, it's a beautiful precision engineered model of our home planetary system, as well as a practical and accurate scientific tool. Its development involved painstaking research and it includes many design firsts for a model Tellurian. You can observe the accurate daily rotation of the Earth, demonstrating day and night. You can see how the Earth's axis is fixed in space and how this influences the changing seasons. Follow the Moon's orbit around the Earth. See how the Moon's orbit is inclined at 5 degrees and rises and falls on an inclined track and how the precession of the Moon's axis is accounted for by rotating the inclined track. You can also observe the rotation of the Sun and how the Earth and Moon system rotate around the Sun. There's a resettable year counter and an indicator for the elliptical orbit of the Moon to demonstrate the animalistic month, allowing the differentiation between total and annular eclipses. You can follow the synodic monthly orbit of the Moon, observe a draconic month, and understand the 18-year Saros cycle. Using the model, you'll also gain an understanding of the phases of the Moon. In all, there are eight different drivetrains within the model. Dates are clearly engraved on the base plate and the constellations are engraved around the drum. The Earth and Moon are intricately coloured, and the series is completed with an illuminating sun. No specialist tools or any adhesives are required to assemble the model. All you'll need are 1.5, 2, 2.5 and 5 mm Allen keys, sometimes called hex wrenches, and small Phillips head screwdrivers. Do not use posidrive or other crosshead screwdriver types. We recommend you use the Tellurian Toolkit, which is supplied free to subscription customers. See our website for full details. Unpack all parts carefully and note that some smaller parts are taped to the inside of the packaging. When assembling parts, lay them on a flat table and keep screws and all small items on a saucer or tray so they can't roll away and get lost. Ensure you read all the instructions in the magazines thoroughly when assembling the parts. Look carefully at the parts list and the exploded diagrams before starting each assembly phase. Part numbers in the list are shown on the exploded diagram and all step-by-step -step assembly diagrams. This video is provided as an introductory guide only. Good luck!